my, it's my favorite color, guys. Yellow. Oh my yellow. God, you said you, you hate yellow. I know, she gave me yellow. It's the bag I gave my mom a long time ago, before. It's yellow. Favorite niya kasi yung color. yellow. Okay. Uh, my dearest Karen, this is for my mom. Kamusta ka na? I am amazed at how fast you adjusted here in the outside world. Oof. It's unbelievable that despite... Sorry, English, guys. Huh? <laughs> it's unbelievable that despite the dark pit where you came from, you emerged to be someone with full of positivity. I'm happy that you're given the chance to start working on your dreams at this early. Although I am a bit sad that you have to leave our house too soon to join there. I'm sending to you the story birch handbag that you gave me years ago it was one of the special stuff that I treasure most because it was <laughs> now we know <laughs> yeah, guess. favorite okay. uh, favorite daughter when you let go you know uh, may na take home oath as one of the elected board of directors of a business organization. I really like this bag as I can put it inside not only my personal stuff but also some important documents that I carry for work. I like its I like its bright color although I know that you don't like the shade now. <laughs> but knowing you, you will soon get over with it. You have been in the worst situations. Whew. But it never dampened your spirit. You came out full of hope and positivity. I know you will be able to inspire more people when you start sharing your experience. More people... Okay. Continue to be the light and spread the love while you are there. In such short time, many people who are stressed out, downtrodden, depressed, lonely, and hopeless said they realize how blessed are, how blessed they are after reading your blogs and blogs. Just being able to lift their spirit is already an accomplishment. Always remember that you have a mission to help others feel the love of God. Good luck in starting another chapter in your life. We all want you to succeed. Take care and stay safe always. We miss you and bear in mind that we are always there for you. Love you, Karensky. Always, Mommy. Favorite. Okay. So. <laughs> Itong bag na to, bigay ko to sa mom ko. Kasi, uh, ever since before, ako palagi namimigay sa family ko. Especially sa mom ko, gustong-gusto ko talaga siyang i-spoil lahat ng pwede ko ibigay na gifts, bibigay ko sa kanya. I'm actually very generous. Tapos, never ako humingi, never ako humingi ng tulong, ganun. Tapos, para lang bigay ko sa inyo background ko, hindi ako nagkaroon ng okay. Okay? So, parang, it came to a point na, uh, my mom kasi is in the professional world, my entire family, professional sila lahat. Oh my gosh. Bali mo to ba si Ay, hindi, masyadong maganda yan. Okay. Alright. Tapos, yung, yung family ko, 
uh, in, yung entertainment world, kakaiba talaga sa kanila. Like, parang it's uh, bordering unacceptable. Kasi they're all professionals. Tapos ako, gustong-gusto ko talaga express yung sarili ko. Kasi nung bata ako, binuli ako ng todo-todo, kinder to high school na Tangit daw ako, baitim daw ako kasi school ko pang mga tisay, pang mga yayamanin, kami normal lang kami. So, yung puso ko, gusto ko nalang ipakita na wag niyong ibabagsak ang isang tao for, you know, like physical or kung ano mang hindi nila kaya ibuga sa tao. Dahil, you know, hindi niyo kilala kung sino tayo, meron tayong mga puso at meron tayong, may, may, may glow tayo na lalabas at lalabas at the right time. So don't you dare put me down. Okay, so. We got you. We got it. Favorite daughter. Sabi ko lang. So, so nung, nung after high school, talagang sabi ko, okay, pag college ko, kasi kakaibang world na yon. iba na yung mga tao, hindi na pare-parehong mga mukha, iibahin ko na talaga yung persona ko. Hindi na ako maging introvert, pero medyo introvert pa rin ako. Sabi ko, I'm going to be more vocal, I'm going to be more active in theater, I'm going to sing kahit na hindi talaga ako masyadong magaling kumunta. I'm going gonna, gonna to do everything to express myself. So, after college, yun, nag-project projects na ako, nag-mod niya ako, kahit hindi masyadong accept yung face na to. And then, uh, I realized I talk a lot, so I want to get into radio. So, everything was going well. Everything was going well. I even did a show with ABS, etc. Tapos, parang my career was on sky high. Like, mga... 2011 to 2016. Nagti-TV na ako. Dami ko ng mga movie na I did a show with Alexa. I mean, I interviewed you. Things were great. Like, I had a online business and I the night before that happened, I even received an award for my online business which you were, uh, uh, ano, uh, Lai was one of my endorsers. Okay? So, things were sobrang, parang everything was going well. Pero inside, parang inside, I'm like, how can I express myself with the audience I have if I'm not feeling like nakadaan ako sa isang mahirap na experience? Paano ko magpapatuwa ng mga tao kung hindi ko ma-express? Na kung, hindi ko, kung hindi ko alam ang sadness, hindi ko alam ang hirap ng buhay, paano ko papasayin ng mga tao talaga ng todo-todo? So, parang nangiisip ako, nawawala na yung creativity ko, nasa radyo ko. Pero yung, yung dating fire noon, na yung pagbubuli sa akin nung, nung schooling, ko, wala na. So, ano bang fire na kailangan ko? So, anyway, so, nung night na nangyari yon <laughs> nangyari yon nangyari yon yung, alam niyo yung hiya na yung pangalan mo, may medyo na buong mundo na, na yung ikaw ang gumawa ng certain na thing na uh, sobrang uh, out of character na ako pa nga nasasabi sa mga tao, huwag wag mo gagawin yun na dahil, you know, it's gonna be bad for for your future, gusto ko maganda yung mga pipiliin mo sa buhay na yun kasi gusto ko yung talents mo talaga ipupursue mo yung, yung gusto ko talaga mag-push sa mga tao na yung maging someone sa, bu- sa buhay tapos ako pa talaga sa lahat ng tao na mabait naman ako hindi naman ako arogante hindi naman ako masama sa kapwa ko i-judge nyo so <sighs> <laughs> so that went on for months like siguro mga 3 months been 4 months dire diretso yung news parang naka, ako lang talaga yung tinitingnan ng masamang tao hindi ko naman ma-defend ang sarili ko so lahat ng vinyl ko lahat ng hirap ko nawala alam mo yun napakabilis talaga pag may nag nag an lang turo lang sa iyo na kunyari may buwa, lahat 'yon wala. Pinalimutan na lahat 'yon. Parang chismis lang 'yun eh, 'di ba? So, I just want to thank my mom. My mom who has been my rock, my entire family, who never abandoned me in the entire time. Kasi hawak ko yung pangalan ko eh, Karen board the door. So, lahat ng mga hawak ko na family, konti lang naman kami. Lahat ng mga little things, position ng mom ko, businesses namin, lahat daw yun. Pati kondo ko nga na, na, na maliit lang, na sobrang proud ko si Nair sa vlog ko. Sabi lahat daw yun, bilid daw galing sa alay, illegal substance. Really? Lahat ng 
get up now. accusation na yun, di ba? Tapos kahit na dinefend ang in court, wala. One evening, and it went years and years, and it was so hard inside. So, prang hindi na intuition. Yung yun na nararamdaman yun. Alam ko yung ram, yung sila sabi yung miss na miss na kayo. Imagine five years ko pinagtaanan yun. Ang tagal talaga. Alam niyo, yung, yung dadalawin ka, hindi mo man, hindi ka pwedeng makasama na pag-uwi nila. May kita mo yung kotse, pero hindi, ka, hindi mo kaya sumama. Ang magsusensin, ang magbibigay sila ng pagkain sa'yo, tapos alam mo yun, yung luto nila sa bahay yun, tapos di ka kasama. Christmas, di ka na naman kasama. Every year. So, so, hinintayin namin talaga this moment, this year. This 2021 ka. Iba po talaga sa Lord. Kahit na it's the pandemic, gumawa siya ng my year. I don't know how, I don't know why. It, it happened. <laughs> Close tayo, di ba? Close na tayo. Okay, ano you know, so I again so I don't know how I don't know why I just want to say thank you thank you to PVB for giving me this amazing opportunity Again, kasi uh, uh, ang hirap talaga, hindi yung, ang hirap um, mag-umpisa. Especially you guys, you're like 18, 19, 25. I'm starting at what age? You know what I mean? Five years taken out of my life. Parang inisip ko na lang, you know, these were fruitful years of, of just controlling my heart and soul. And believing na talaga may magandang kalalabasan to. So now I'm here. God, it's God's time, you know. When He says it's time to shine, it's time to shine. So, thank you, Mom. Thank you, Dad. Thank you to my sisters, favorite daughter.